All right, let's walk into the 2021 Nautica 35MS. Walking into the front section here, captain's chair. There's a video screen that uh, as you turn your blinkers on, it runs down the side of the coach right hand left hand and uh, camera in the back all digital dash stereo with navigation I actually bought a better navigation that keeps us on the truck roads um, that I would give along with the deal some more switches on the dash your climate control in the front generator start lock the door a couple of little buttons there um, you got your oh your air suspension and your lights and your air brakes there um, coming on up here we've got a TV up front and uh, you got your shades Let's see, uh, you've got your shades in the front, shades on the side. Turning around, this seat here turns around and has a recliner built into it. Actually, this seat also turns around for when you're camping. Heading out into the living room, dinette space. This couch folds down to a bed, the table goes down bed folds flat. We upgraded that table to a Corian, solid Corian table. The table that came with it we thought was kind of cheap and it rattled. Um, just felt flimsy so we put a Corian table there. Storage up above, plenty of lighting. Um, this bed right here actually is a motorized bed that comes down. It won't come down right now. I got the engine actually running, but uh, that comes down to just about the level of the seats. And uh, there's some stairs that uh, you can climb up into that uh, upper bunk area. Um, these are a couple of uh, theater chairs. Hit a button and they, they recline on out. Both of them do that. Some remote control or magazine storage. Got your, you got your daytime shades and your uh, nighttime shades on all the windows. Got the fireplace, I think with a 12,000 BTU heater in it. Um, main TV in the, in the living space. Kitchen area. Nice stainless steel, deep stainless steel farm sink. Um, convection microwave oven. You got your induction cooktop, two burner. There is no LP on this coach. It's all uh, runs off from diesel or electric. Um, you got your residential refrigerator on the top. And your, your freezer in the bottom. And it does have an ice maker built in. The coach is winterized currently. That's why the pink is in the ice maker. Bathroom, toilet, small sink, actually a very nice sized shower um, with a legit door. I'm six foot five, 250 pounds, and I can fit in there very nicely. Nice uh, fan. There's also a fan in the kitchen. Air conditioner up front air conditioner and heat pump in the back um, step up into the into the uh, master suite or you can walk through the bathroom to the master suite this bed actually is a uh, an adjustable bed that uh, moves up for travel and then and then uh, comes on down and lays flat for uh, for when you're sleeping this is what we liked about the back was the master suite is huge, plenty of storage, um, plenty of 
plenty of room to move around and get ready for doing whatever you're doing. Um, nice lavatory sink in the master suite, separate from the bathroom. So let's say she can be getting ready for the evening or whatever and uh, you can still be using the shower or the bathroom at the same time. Um, this coach is prepped for a washer and dryer. Um, but we did not get the washer and dryer, so we keep it for a linen closet slash utility closet. Nice vanity, lit vanity. Um, tons of, tons and tons of uh, storage for clothing. Hanging closet. We've taken all of our clothes out since the last time we were traveling. Um, TV in the master, hang our towels.